feels like rendezvous You know what to do Keep your love for me only I get high on you Welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a haul for you guys on some plus size clothing that I have found. You guys know that I've been like struggling to find some cute pieces lately. I'm just not inspired by the fashion trends or the fashion world right now. Um, however, these two stores that I'm going to be sharing with you are both from the UK. However, they do ship to the US. And I'm not sure if they ship worldwide or not, but I will leave the website and everything that you need to know in the description bar down below so you can go ahead and check that out if you're worried about like shipping to your country. So the first store I'm gonna be talking about is a store called Pink Clove. Now they are from the UK. So Pink Clove actually reached out to me and asked me if I wanted to review some of their clothes. So of course I said yes, because I'm always excited to learn about different and new plus size clothing stores. I don't believe Pink Clove is a new brand. However, I just haven't heard about them a lot. So I was like, of course. I would love to check them out. Um, I do believe they did sell some of their items on ASOS before. You know how ASOS sometimes has like different retailers clothes on their website? I believe I've ordered something from Pink Clove before, but it was a couple of years ago. So of course I wanted to check them out again um, and they sent me a couple items. So I'm excited to show you guys those. And then I do have some other items from ASOS that I ordered on my own, obviously, and just wanted to share them with you because they were some really cute summer items. So let me jump in. I'm going to start with the items from Pink Clove. Now, if you're interested in any of these items, I do actually have a discount code with Pink Clove. It's Fortunato30, so that'll get you 30% off anything on the website except for the sale items. So yeah, if you want any of these things, definitely use that code and save yourself 30% off. But all the items that I do show you today from both retailers will be linked in the description bar down below so you guys can go ahead and check them out. Um, but the first thing I want to talk about is this bodysuit. I've been obsessed with this shade of nude. I love it. It's just a beautiful, like, rich, brown-toned, blushy nude. I love it. This one has a square neck, and it has a nice thick strap so you can wear a bra. You don't have to worry about wearing a strapless bra or anything uncomfortable. Um, and it is a bodysuit. So it clips down there at the crotch. Uh, the one thing I do have to say is this is a little bit short-waisted. Um, so, and it's just the way that it's cut. If you can see, that's kind of basically all. This is the top of the bodysuit, and this is like where you would, your hip would be. So that's kind of all the room that you have. So it is a little bit short-waisted for me, but that's not going to stop me from wearing it. I will just tuck it into my pants like a regular shirt and be good to go. Um, but I did order this in a size US 20. They do go up to, I believe, a US 24 and 26. All the other items I'm going to be showing you are in a US 24, just for reference. Um, but this one was in a 20. So I love this color. It's like, I just think it makes like your skin pop, your hair pop, your eyes pop. I, I love this color. I don't actually have the prices because they're not listed on the tag, but again, everything will be in the description box. The next thing is this dress, also obviously from Pink Clove. It is so cute. It has the same kind of like nudie color. This one's a little bit lighter. Um, as far as the background, it has a nice half sleeve. And then it has like a Dalmatian type pattern. If you can see those spots there, it's almost like in between a Dalmatian pattern and like an abstracted like heart pattern. Um, but I'm gonna say Dalmatian pattern. It has a faux wrap on the top and then it flares out to a nice little like skater style skirt. And it does have a tulip style bottom if you can see that with a ruffle right there. Love this dress, however, it's a little bit short on me. Um, so I'm 5'9", in case you guys are wondering, but it is a little bit short on me. I'd probably just throw on a pair of biker shorts underneath it and be fine, but really, really cute. The next thing is this, it's like in between a duster and like a little blazer, but I love this color. It's a really nice cool toned gray. It's almost like a icy gray where it almost has like a little bit of blue tones to it. It's just a really beautiful color. Um, and the fabric is nice and stretchy on it, so you don't have to worry about that. It has a collar and a little lapel here. And then the back has a little tie. You can leave it open or closed. I just tied it in a little bow in the back of my waist. And it does have some faux pockets right there, if you can see. This one goes down to about, I believe, a little bit past my hip. That's why I said it's like kind of in between a duster and a blazer. But it's super cute. I cannot wait to wear this as well. Perfect for this season, too. It's not heavy. It's like very lightweight stretchy comfortable fabric all right the next two things you can kind of wear them together or separate they um they are the same pattern so you can wear them as a set but personally i would probably wear them separately um it is a snake skin patterned legging 
is the first thing. It's like a nice legging. It has a pocket. I don't know if these are supposed to be like joggers, but they definitely fit me more like a legging. Um, they're straight all the way down. And then they have a pocket. But they are cute. Personally, a little bit out of my comfort zone. I don't know that I would feel comfortable uh, to wear these. They're not exactly 100% my style, but I wanted to kind of like step out of the box a little bit. Um, so I got these. And then the duster that goes with it is just a nice long duster. Um, again, it has a nice collar and lapel here. Long sleeve and goes, this one goes all the way down to about mid calf. So it's definitely more of a duster and it is a nice stretchy fabric, nice and lightweight. I could totally see this with like a pair of ripped black jeans and a black bodysuit and some heels and perfect for like a night out on like a date night or if you're going out with the girls or whatever. I think it's really, really cute. And the last thing I got from Pink Clove, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, it's not exactly my style. I don't love the dress. I find this to be a little bit more um, of a mature style. But it is this teal colored dress. It's a high low, uh, if you can see that. And then the top here has some straps and then a little piece for your shoulder, which I think is cute. The straps are a little bit too big on me. And then I do like the neckline of this. It's a really beautiful like sweetheart cut, which I think is very flattering and very pretty. Um, just not exactly my style and not exactly like my color. So. This one was a little bit of a fail, but that's okay. Okay, so that's all I have from Pink Clove. I'm gonna show you the ASOS things now. Again, if you wanna shop anything from Pink Clove, you can use my discount code, and I will have everything listed in the description box down below. Now, as far as ASOS goes, again, it was kind of a little bit of a hit or miss. All the items are super cute. It's just that the sizing was a little bit off. Um, all right, let me talk about, I'll talk about this shirt first. So this shirt on the website looked absolutely adorable. Like so, so cute, so my style. It's an off the shoulder white top with some ruffles here and then it has um, almost like the detached sleeve here that you just stick your arm in and the sleeve has two ruffles on it. It's so cute. And then it has these like beautiful eyelet details, if you can see that there. And so I ordered a size 24 because I thought this was gonna be a woven style top. And when I got it, the body of the top is a cotton fabric and it's really oversized, like it's really big, um, if you can see that. So I actually just ordered it in a size 20. I felt like I needed to go down two sizes. So yeah, if you wanna order this top, I would definitely recommend sizing down. It's pretty, pretty large. Um, I made it work and I just kind of like tucked it into the pair of shorts, which you guys will see in the try on, but it's definitely large. That being said, it's so cute though. I love it. It's so cute. So yeah, I got this one in the US 24. These are the shorts that I tucked it in with. Again, I wish I got these in a size down. I got these in a 24 as well. I wish I got these in a 22. Uh, they're a little bit big for me in the waist. I have a little bit of a gap, which I don't think you can see in the try on, but it's there but they're super cute they're on a black pattern with this white floral detailing they're really really cute like soft stretchy shorts asos has hands down my most favorite kind of shorts and it's this kind i believe they call them the culotte short um i love them though like literally i have probably like eight pairs of different style culotte shorts from asos i just love them they are a summer staple for me hands down obsessed I would definitely size down in these. These are a little bit too big for me, but yeah, super cute. They don't have pockets or anything either, just a little fact. Same thing with the black pair. You can never go wrong with a pair of black culotte shorts. They're just super cute, like flowy shorts. Almost, with both pairs, it almost looks like you're wearing a skirt um, because the leg of them are super flowy, and that's how they're supposed to be. I wear mine high-waisted with shirts tucked into them, and I just think they look so cute. So I, of course, had to pick up a pair of black ones for the summer. The next thing is this top that I'm wearing here. This is such a pretty blouse. Um, in the try and I tried it on with the black jeans. I've already worn this top and I wore it with a pair of like ripped cropped denim and a pair of little like Birkenstocky type of sandals. It is so cute. It has the prettiest, prettiest details. I don't know if it's gonna focus, but around the cuff of the wrist, it has this eyeletty pretty detail with a nice scallop hem on it. It's so cute. The whole top is a crinkle fabric which is really, really cute. It has a layer right here. And then it does have some buttons that go down it, if you can see that there. This shirt is a little bit see-through, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. Um, you can see your bra 
or anything you wear underneath your clothes as far as shapewear. So like I can't wear black shapewear with this top because it's see-through. Um, but it's a beautiful top. It's nice and lightweight. That's why like right now it's 80 degrees and I'm wearing it totally fine. So it is a thin enough fabric that you can wear it right now in the summertime, even though it does have long sleeves. It's just a beautiful like feminine top in my opinion. It's just really cute. It has some like boho-y type of vibes, but super cute. Um, and then the last thing I want to show you guys from ASOS are a pair of black jeans. ASOS does also home some of my most favorite jeans. Be warned though, I would recommend sizing down at least one size. If you've never tried ASOS denim before, they run pretty big because they have a lot of stretch in them. Um, so personally, I always size down two sizes, sometimes even three. Um, it just kind of depends on the jean, but yeah. So I know that's kind of like, it's kind of hard to gauge your size if you've never shopped there and you want to buy their jeans. But I would definitely recommend sizing down at least one to two sizes um, if you've never tried them before. So these ones are a pair of black denim. Just a nice good pair of high-waisted black denim. They have a nice split knee here, ripped knee, and then their skinny jean. You guys know I love some destructed denim, so I had to get these. Um, I have a pair of black jeans from Fashion to Figure, which I absolutely love, but they're super, super faded now, so I figured it was time to pick up a new pair. However, these feel super, super similar. Um, the fabric is very similar and very stretchy, if you see that like super stretchy they're really a nice fitting jean sorry i just adjusted my brightness i feel like it's been super bright this entire video but this is my second time filming it this video so i'm hoping that even if the lighting was a little off it still works um but yeah absolutely love this jean it fits perfectly super flattering very high rise definitely comes up to like the smallest part of my waist which i really appreciate um and yeah, I love these. So definitely check out ASOS and Pink Clove if you've never checked out either of them before. ASOS is absolutely, hands down, one of my most favorite brands. And Pink Clove does have some really, really cute, trendy options that I'm excited to share with you guys. So let me know if you guys have any recommendations down below of where you'd want to see the next haul from. I love you guys all so, so much. Thank you so much for watching, and I will talk to you soon. Bye.